Frawley back in the side, 2-1 win, you must be happy with that today. Yeah, definitely. I think the boys were excellent today. We didn't think it was going to be an easy game at all and we, the coaching staff prepped well on them and gave us all the information we needed and I think the boys dug deep and we got the result we needed. And for you, obviously, a little while since you played first team football, obviously had a loan at Hampton. How are you feeling after a bit of a long spell out? Yeah, had a long time out, but no, it's just good to be out there again after a long 10 weeks. Um, but yeah, I feel very fine. I feel good, ready to go again. Because of course, your last game for us was in the league against Wrexham. Now you're playing in the FA Trophy for us. You know, a bit of a different opposition to Wrexham, but how would you find playing against Kingstonian today? Yeah, no, it's definitely different, but it's it's never going to be a nice game against Kingstonian. It's never going to be easy. They're always gritty and they're tough, and it's always going to be a fight. So I knew that I had to be strong and tough and fight for my space. I just spoke about it. He maybe didn't want to give you as long as he did, just because it's been a while for you. But playing 90 minutes, you feel fit? You feel okay after that? Yeah, nah. I thought I was coming off a of 45, but nah. Stuck, dug deep and I stayed on. and Yeah, I feel fine. I don't know about tomorrow, but I'm <laughs> fine today. Let's talk about the first half. Obviously, we find ourselves 1-0 down. Bit of a sucker punch, really, given how well we've done in that first half. We come in in the second half, get two quick fire goals. What was the message from the manager at half-time? Uh, no, nah, the game plan was there. It was there, but we just weren't executing it well. We were just doing misplacing passes. We weren't getting tight enough. And then Gaffer spoke to us at half-time, and we came out second half firing, ready to go, and luckily got the result. Joined, obviously, the back four there. You had Wagstaff to your right. Obviously, Alfie came in there. Corey Jordan next to you. How much of a help were they for you today in that in that partnership? Uh, definitely, they were both excellent. Even Alf, Waggy was in there talking all the time. His experience helped me a lot today. And Corey, who's played a lot of games as well, was just talking to me constantly, helped me through the game. Obviously, we spoke about Kingstonian being a lower league opposition. We struggled against lower league opposition against Bowers and Pitsy earlier on. How important was it to make sure we overcome that and make sure the result, you know, a bit of a shock doesn't happen again today? Yeah, we couldn't we couldn't take another shock again. We took one against Bowers and Pitsy and now it was time to put it right and get on the road. A trip to Wembley would be nice and hopefully we keep going. You personally, obviously, be hoping for a starting place in the National League next week against arguably the biggest rivals in this league? Yep, hopefully. I think I've earned my space and I've worked hard over the last couple of weeks with my injury and come back fit and strong. Let's talk about working, obviously. You know, they don't get much bigger than that. A massive game for the club and for the fans as well. Yeah, definitely. Just need everyone behind us. Hopefully have a big turnout and hopefully we're all up for it, ready to go. Let's talk about the fans today. You know they were growing great voice today. It must have shown you a lot of appreciation to see you back out on the pitch. Yeah, definitely. I've never played with a crowd before. It was that big, and yeah, it was definitely they were all behind us, pushing us on. That definitely that second half, and we needed it the most. So yeah. What would have been great for the academy is obviously seeing so many boys come through. You know, you got yourself, you got Tommy, you have Alfie's cup tie, but even had Lucius and Woody on the bench today. It must be great to have some friendly faces. You know, well from the academy. No, definitely. The academy works very hard to produce players and. I think they're doing a great job down there because look at the boys that come through and they're getting a run out of games. Tommy, Alfie, they've played five games now each and the, the young boys who are working hard just get breaking through now are de getting on the bench, so that's what they want. For you, it's obviously about keeping the place, looking to fight for a starting lineup place from now on. Yeah, definitely. I'm just going to keep fighting, not be really give up. If there's down moments, then I'll just pick myself up and go again. Are you a movie shot? Look below for more information. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe.